Burn out. Yep. Hundred percent. So this is the same stage that I was on that I ended on last night. Oh, it's pretty pretty dang long. The first part is very frustrating uh, until you know what to do. It did not explain anything in a cutscene. It just kind of did its thing. And obviously that's a fancy loading zone. So here I am in a, in a place. Well, it's definitely running better. So you see that dog up there? I didn't realize, but what you have to do... Is not be seen by it. Yeah, literally not be seen by it. And it's a reoccurring thing, and it's pretty annoying. Go ahead, dog, go down. You can't kill it. What does it do? Like when it sees you? Does it, it just summon? runs away. Oh. It can't hurt you. Where are we at, lads? There we go. Also, the line of sight of this thing is ridiculous. Did it see you? Wow. I swear that it takes a different... I swear it takes a different route every time. You should probably be less... I will. Once I see it, I'll move. Okay, so it's gonna come around. <laughs> what is this banjo music? I mean, not banjo-kazooie music, but like banjo, the instrument music. Did it just fart out ghost energy? <laughs> That's a lot of here. Uh, shotgun bullets. I'm honestly surprised it didn't see me. Like I said, the line of sight for this sucks. Yeah, it was probably because you were on the left edge, I'm gonna guess. And it'll turn around randomly, just like that. Sometimes it'll uncover, like, it's just, like, it literally, like, is, like, a dog, where it'll just, you know, stop and uncover stuff, and sometimes it'll uncover freaking ghosts, and you're like, dude, please stop. Okay, I don't know if I'm too far away. The thing's only open for a little bit of time, I think. Okay, so this room's pretty annoying, because he's gonna start uncovering ghosts because reasons. We gotta wait for him to open a certain door. This is a weird first level. I feel like this should be like, I mean first like actual level I guess. hard to control because there is to my knowledge no lock on obviously lock on would make this game ridiculously easy it seems like the analog stick movement is just has like weird acceleration on it it's not as easy as it is. Yeah. so okay good the, the ghost is actually still looking around which is good surprise it didn't see me Good. Yeah, the music is very weird in this game. Yeah, I thought there was like actually like a banjo in it for a little while, but I haven't heard since. Oh, okay. Oh. I'm just gonna stay here until they come over to me. Oh, is it just waiting for me to. cycle, but I had to... Actually... No, that's not where I wanted. 
Whoop. Much better. Okay. Get out of here, stupid dog. I will say, it's just, this is just a weird thing. Like, it's a weird enemy. Yeah, it's just, it's such a weird, like, first level. No explanation, just sort of exists. Yeah. And then afterwards, it's like, shoot a Rama. So we gotta wait for it to go to the door to the left. So what we wanted it for it to do is go to sleep. That's the time you can hurt it. And we want to collect ghosts because we're a freaking ghost hunter. I think there was an is that an item? That green thing? Yes, that's right. You actually you actually need that. So Astral now has the charming ability because I got that. I have not had a chance to use it because in the whole time I was in this level, there wasn't any other, um, I mean, parts with Astral. I don't know how that all works and everything, but, uh, so I got, oh yeah, I use it here. Yes, sir. So I got a, uh, crowbar. The crowbar. <laughs> did, did I not get the crowbar? Huh. That's definitely what you do, but maybe maybe I just didn't pick up the crowbar. Like, too much was happening, you know? Like, it was like, hey, you got the ability, and then it didn't, like, reference me picking it up. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, I literally did not pick up the crowbar. There was too much going on. Okay. Oh, and by the way, whenever you, whenever you see that uh, thing... Yeah, so this is... Oh, it's so bright on this TV. But it, this will show you, like, all the different, like, notes you have. So, like, the professor was here, blah, blah, blah. So, like, if you're kind of confused about where you go, it'll, it'll show you there. So far, the game's pretty self-explanatory. It's not like... Yeah, I'm not going to pretend that I, like, figured out what to go instantly, but there's not that many places to go, so... Yeah, it seems pretty linear. Yeah... You can save at any time, but obviously it only restarts at checkpoints. So that's all you have to do in here is pick that up. I forget if there's any other items, really. I do not believe. So can you shoot these? I forget. You can. Yeah, I still don't know why you pick up a shotgun. Unless, like Trev said, you, uh, re, uh... I mean, maybe, like, something like those barrels you can destroy environment. Or something. I guess. Or maybe at some point you fight. I forgot about that. BTFO! Okay. I hate this next room because there's like four flying guys. Epic. I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna get them off. Excuse me. Also, the, the hit detection on if they go down too far and they're near the spikes is very difficult. Like that. It's so bright. What is going on? I think there's one more. It's probably because we cranked the brightness on this TV to max. Pretty much. Where's that third one? Is it right? Oh, it's right on me! Actually, you know, so... Bruh. Come on. Yeah, this uh, this little design seems like especially annoying, specifically for these enemies. It's because they go down too far. Here we go. Here we go. 
And where's my last guy? Oh, yeah, yeah. We like it when you go higher. Where are you at? Oh, don't even care. Sweet. It's like down to 97. No, 97. Oh, no. All right, so we're continue on our way. We are going to, got about 15 minutes left, so this is perfect. This is just about where I wanted to be. It's good. I'm probably at this point, maybe like 20 minutes further than this, 20, 30 minutes. So we're gonna meet the best character in the game. Keep out. Do not touch Willy, good advice. Music. Don't take another step, please, Mr. Fancy Bridges. Okay, you just keep calm, ma'am. I'm a police officer. A police officer? You're human. How did you get here? The, uh, the camera angles on hers are so weird. It's just like, as now close up as humanly possible. In my virtue, young stranger, make no mistake about it. Calm down, you don't need your gun. Why I'm here is, well, it's a long story, man, but basically, I was... Stupid then, Madison. Listen, you have to help me. I'm coming for the children. You, you have, have to, to do, do something. something. Let's just start from the beginning, can we? Okay, nice and calm. Who exactly? The spirits! Who do you think? They'll be here any minute. This music is so unfitting. He's been called away. Yep. Can you help us? I can see so we're just practicing piano. Sensitive. They're like, use it. Okay, I'll, I'll take a look around. You stay here, please, ma'am. Uh, I could maybe use some backup out here. Do you have a phone I could use? A phone? They'll be here any minute. Backup, indeed. Comes in here tramping dirt all over a dignified lady's floor. Phone's in the hallway. No charge. Charge. That seemed perfectly normal. Yeah. Let me just use this phone. What backup are you calling for? Okay, nothing. Hmm. Okay. Officer Jones, I'm picking up a different type of ghost uh, I'm previously encountered. Thank you. Your grenade will be of no use here. I recommend caution in the extreme. In the extreme. So these new guys, I forget what they say. There's a new type of creature. Yeah, there we go. So. She's mad, but I'll check out her story. Wow. These are the new guys. Not great. So you don't use the grenade against them. You can shoot them and kill them, though, but they just, like, disappear. Hmm. And it's, uh... So what, you just ignore them or run away? Uh, I shoot them. Just because they all have, like, long-range attacks. Whee! I forgot about that for a second. What is happening? Especially his beloved mother and by the whole community. His tireless work, his boundless energy. He made all this work. Oh my god, could I be worse? Say, don't make me leave you, son. Excellent. Oh, that was weird. I never got out of first person view or shooting view. Yeah, that was some crazy platforming. Yeah, contact sensitive push X to jump. Hey, well, you know, it's pretty hardcore. Do I need some life? 
No, I do not. 100 life, boys! Okay, so now we're at... What is this Halo music, dude? I know. It's pretty funky. I think this one he says it's a ghost town. So we're gonna go... We got about 10 minutes left. We're gonna go until maybe one or two more checkpoints. This is the Wild West in that all it's gonna be is just constant shooting. And it sucks. Nothing like a ghost game where it's the cover shooter. Well, here's the thing, there's no cover. So you just shoot those guys until they disappear? Do they like reappear or you just can't capture them? No, they don't reappear. Okay. Good. Okay. But the thing is there's so many of them and they're such good shots that you really don't want to mess around. Good, good on all that. Good. And this is also kind of like a maze. What is this? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, well, look like actual bullets. See, this is kind of like a maze too, so you kind of have to find your way around and all that. Wait till you see the big versions of those guys. Oh, oh boy. Very cool. The window. has an effect. I can kill it. It just, I just can't. I don't know why it said no effect. Yeah, the stipulation of not being able to capture them is very odd because you just shoot them anyway. Maybe there they'll explain it later. Oh, they have a chainsaw. I guess there's a reason why you have an ammo limit. That took like 80 bullets. No. Okay. Not a huge deal because they just do. They just take that money. Okay, so we're gonna head up here. There's a couple guys up here. Yep. down here. Like I said, it's just a big, weird maze. I wouldn't even say necessarily a maze. Just kind of like follow the weird places they want you to go. Point A to B kind of thing. Kind of reminds me of Ravenholm from uh, Half-Life 2. Yeah, I can see that. Where it's kind of like the puzzle is getting through the weird environment. You have to like follow him again. Let's see if you get. Okay, I want this because reasons. That's what I'm going Run, booty. What is he doing? Yeah I, think, yeah, I think that's the whole point of coming up here, is you want to scare him down. Yeah. Yeah. It's just, it's a weird mixture of puzzle and shooter, where like when these things are around, it's a puzzle, because you have to just like, and not even necessarily a puzzle, just don't get seen, you know? Because if you're like, if you come to a dead end, it's like, well, what do I do? Well, this dumb dog opens up the door, you know? All right, so. Let's see if we can 
follow it and not get seen. It's going to turn around at some point. Okay, what are you doing? I turn into sparkles, dude. Music once again, super chill. Oh, that's good. I will actually take that 100%. Turn the corner. Damn it. Yeah, you can't get too far away from these guys or else they just zip to you. I was about to say that one was easier. It was not. Certainly a bullet sponge. Yeah, I can't see you like a sniper rifle being useful at all. At least not at this point. Maybe at some point. Alright, so unfortunately, yeah, we have to follow him again. As dumb as that is. Uh, when we get to the next checkpoint, we'll call it a part, which actually is only. I mean, they give out checkpoints pretty liberally. Yeah, and at this point, I'm... Oh, crap. I can unfortunately see people getting pretty turned off on this game because of this level. I think they just did it too early. Like, if they did just, like, a normal, straightforward level for the first level... Um, I think they just did this too fast. In my opinion. There he is! So the general thing that I get from this is uh, actually is that uh, these ghosts are like the town. It's like the, the townsfolk who were like killed or whatever in this ghost town. And now they're like protecting their property. Yeah, that's good. Okay. Oh, that's right. This one threw me off last time, too. You literally go down here. Water. I press down on that D-pad. That's the sound I make all the time. Yeah. Don't know what it is. And now the music is very peaceful again. Let's clamor. What's the word they use? Clamor. Okay. There is a banjo. That was a wrong. Yeah, you were right. Next time we will finish up, let me just save, new file, next time we will uh, we'll continue this, I actually don't know at this point because I haven't practiced too much farther than this, I don't know what's coming up afterwards, so uh, we're about, I'm going to guess one fourth to one fifth done through the day, the game, because the long play is about five hours long, so, and that was, that was about an hour, so. We'll see you next time, lads. Uh, bye bye.